Hello everyone, it's Jaylen. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. First of all, I hope everybody is staying safe during quarantine and you guys are all social distancing and staying home and all that good, good stuff, goodness. Just really just want my camera to focus on me. The last time I went to Repticon, we ended up, my family ended up getting a Jackson Chameleon, Jackson's Chameleon. Um, super dope, three horns, you know, they're really cool. I like, I knew that they existed, but I had never like actually seen one in person and they're really, really cool. Today, I'm going to be showing you his enclosure, not upgrade, but we're just, he's in big wire wire mesh cage right now and we're just gonna like take out his stuff wash it and like redo it all we bought some more stuff to put in it um yeah so i'm just gonna take you guys along that journey with me and you're going to see how that turns out he's excited he's very very friendly he's a sweet very very sweet chameleon he you can tell he trusts you because when you like put your hand in the cage he like reaches out to go on it it's really cute because we're quarantined in our house and i am doing all my classes online and stuff i'm here all the time like everybody else is and so i've been bringing him outside with me and he just kind of hangs out on bushes and i just watch him and he really likes um being in the sun and the heat outside so yeah, he's really cute. Um, I'm excited to introduce him to you guys and I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. It's a really nice temperature outside right now. So we've had his cage sitting out here while he uh, just kind of hangs out. The sun is not on him anymore. It was on him before, but hello, honey. Hi, hon. Oh, are you having fun? Watch this. Hi, come here. Come here. Where are you going? Huh? Hi. Yes, come here. Oh, you're so beautiful. Hi, honey. Say hello to Jax, everyone. That's his name. Forgot to mention that. Spelled J A X. Because he's the Jackson chameleon. How original. Isn't it adorable, though? I think it fits him well. Go on your bush. Here, let's bring you to this bush. You can go on the bush. You can go. Go ahead. Okay. Goodbye. I gotta start off by taking everything out of his cage, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Hello, I am on my phone. Um, I'm gonna take everything out of his enclosure now, so we're gonna like rinse it off with the hose and Yeah, there is a feeder roach in his cage. It's very ugly, but he didn't he didn't like it. He didn't eat it Everything is rinsed off um, with the hose now we gotta wait for it all to dry how you doing, buddy? Hello? He's just hanging out behind me. On a plant. You are going to fall. You cannot do that. You need to go on your plant. Here you go. Here is the plant. Yes, you like plant. Go to plant. Got this um, eco carpet stuff. I'm gonna put it at the bottom of his cage. Um, yeah, I'm gonna cut it and make sure that it's like the right size. Hello. That's really not that big. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be bigger. I'm just cutting a little bit of it off so it fits into the cage better. We can make it work. This is like stained at the bottom because it literally will not come off. So this is what we're working with. This is how big the carpet is compared to the cage. Bottom isn't that important regardless because he's gonna be on the vines like literally all the time. It's just to catch poop. So 
that should be fine. We're using to put in this cage here. Um, I need to figure out, this is new, so I need to figure out how to like put that in there. Try, and there's like some holes in here. I'm gonna try and stick these through the holes and see if it'll stay. Okay, wish me luck, my dudes. Maybe I should put the other one in first. Oh God, this is just like a big bundle of stuff. Oh, this literally is as big as me. Okay, I'm gonna try sticking this through the hole. I think it was in there before, so. Where did, there was like a little section out. Oh, okay. I have no idea how this was in there. Look, this came off. What? Hi, Fletcher. Hey, honey. Goodbye. Okay. I like hooked it on here. I'll show you closer after. Here's what it looks like. I just put a bunch of the vines in there. And yeah, he can like walk there and stuff. He can walk on that. I want him to be able to like stay on things. He can't like grip onto the vines very well, but yeah, he's got that. Okay. That should be good. Okay, I moved his cage to where it normally is. Now I need to find somewhere to put his thermometer. So we're gonna do that. This is, cause there's no other way for me to like, cause there's no hole. So I'm thinking if we just put like, the wire like that, put this? it like that, then I can close it. Okay, it's time for the moment of truth. We're gonna get Jax and put him in his cage. Hello, friend. Here we go. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> Do you like it? Do you like it? You some crickets? Found his spray bottle. I'm gonna miss him. I've been hanging out, watching some YouTube and scrolling through TikTok for like the past hour. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, check on him and see if he's moved at all because he was pretty pissed at me when I put him in the cage because I took him away from his um, exploration time. So BRB. Hey, hey, how you doing? Good morning. Okay, everyone. Well, I hope you guys liked that video, um, and I really hope you guys like Jax. He's a little angel. Um, I have been bonding with him a lot since I have been here because I, the weather has finally been nice out today. It's not a thousand degrees out anymore, which is nice. If you guys want to see any more videos with him or who you would like to see videos with next, um, Leave a like if you liked Jax, I'm sure he would appreciate it. And make sure you follow me on Instagram and add me on Snapchat if you want to talk or see my stories and all that good stuff. So, I'll see you guys in my next video. Goodbye. There are squirrels yelling at me. If you see somebody squatting down on the side of the road talking to a squirrel, that will be me.